What's the meaning of this? Uchechi, I am highly disappointed in you. How could you tell on the princess? Oh, the princess disobeyed the king's order. Unlike you, I am loyal to the king. <laughs> More like you're interested in the king. What's that supposed to mean? You think we don't know you're trying everything to gain the king's favor? Mm -hmm. <laughs> but guess what? No matter how desperately you try, the king will never stop seeing you as what you are. A common palace maid, <laughs> just like us. I might be a palace maid, but I am not small-minded as you two. Hey! Uchechi! Hey! Uchechi! See, how many times did I call you? See, it is very good to be ambitious. But don't let it get to a point where your ambition becomes a tool for your destruction. Hope you get my advice. You are entitled to your own opinion. <laughs> Please, no freaking way. Honestly speaking, this is the only option I can come up with in a time like this. My princess, you know I love you and I will support you in any decision you take. But this one, this very one is really very, very ridiculous. Rena, no matter how ridiculous this may sound, right? It's the best we can come up with. We need to save ourselves. I need to save my family's trust. He also needs to save his throne. Listen, I've run out of options. Prince of Gudiniru should work with what I have. It's okay, just stop worrying. In due time, everything will work out well. Just... Just... That is ridiculous! And there is no way I am going to do that. Zonta, you will do it. I will not. No, you will. I won't. You say you will. The prince promised to reward us handsomely. Zonta, are you addicted to poverty? Ha! Ah, you will. Why me? Why did he choose me? Above every other person. Why? Asomta. Eh? Forget this why me, why me, why is he not you, why is he? The truth is, there is nothing you're doing in this house, Owen. Nothing. It's better you go there. Oh, Briya, Mama. Oh, yeah, Mama. Let me tell you, the prince promised to pay you a huge amount of money. That can even change our lives. Oh, yeah, eh? Asomta. And. You know now. Mm. Mama, please. Mama, very important. If you go to the palace, you will help me speak to the prince to marry me. That way he will understand that I am the only woman that loves him. That way he will marry me. Mama, Oh, yeah, one minute. Oh, yeah, one minute. Please, do it for us. Mm -hmm. The prince promised to reward us. And I am hoping that that reward will eradicate poverty from our family. Bam! Pikonu, Pikonu, Pikonu. Pikonu. Hmm. Hey. This is a bad idea. Very bad idea. And if I must agree to it, me, I have my own terms and conditions, though, because I am nobody's fool. So ha. glad they're <laughs> Mama, happy being so bad, you I sometimes forget that terms and conditions. We're doing this thing for ourselves. Uh -huh. It's for the betterment of our family. It's 
sounds more Money like for yourself. Here, yeah. Asunta, you, you must do this thing. And nobody, nobody, nobody will stop you from doing it. You must do it though. And let me warn you, don't go and start opening that your mouth to go and tell Ekene. I want to tell Ekene. Why? Why would you tell him? Why would I tell him? If you like go, do, 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 do. don't even try it. It's our little secret. Ha! Me, yeah. I, I don't know how to keep secret though. You have to keep it. You must learn how to keep it today, today. Don't tell him, mm. oh, before he's back from Abuja, bam, everything is over. Oh, I'm over yeah, here. Here, come on, take it. Okay, fine. Go ahead and tell us what your terms are. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Is there anything else you want? No. Like you don't need anything, Your Highness. Leave my presence. Yes, Your Highness. You had no courage to speak about your emotions and your feelings towards me. Why? My prince, it's because you see me as a commoner, a common maid. My prince, I worship the ground you walk on. I love you so much, my prince. I gave you all the signals, but you never look my way. And, and, and it's against my wish for me to throw myself on a man who will eventually humiliates and insults me. Now look at where your assumptions has gotten us. I have lost everything, hmm? including the palace. What? My prince, are you saying you've lost the throne? <laughs> In a few days' time, the pronouncement will be made and royalty would leave my family lineage. <sighs> marry me, my prince. My prince, marry me and make me your wife. That way you will not lose the throne. I, I, I love you, my prince. Let me enjoy. Never. Chilota, I do not love you. But thank you for loving me and telling me you love me. I cannot gamble my emotions with marriage. My prince, is it better you gamble it with losing the throne? Eh, hey, my prince? Can't you see I love you so much? I love you, my prince. Can't you feel it? Chiluta, step away. I do not love you. But I care about you. And love, it takes time. It takes a lot of time to love someone. But we can build it. My prince, we have all the time. We have all the time in the whole world for us to build it. My prince, we can build it. No, you're wrong. I do not have all the time. And I do not want to lose the throne. Please leave. I said leave. Mother, that is my decision and it is final. Such decision cannot be final because it happened many years ago. You said you want your daughter's happiness. That should be more important to you than trying to impress the dead. Mother, you are forgetting something. 
It is not my decision, but the decision of our ancestors. Yes. Personal decision that was never a tradition. They were not law, but was born out of enmity. You are a king of peace, and that you should represent. I said no, mother. Mother, I can't fathom this. This is a culture and tradition handed over to me by our ancestors, and I pledge to uphold it. Were you there? Let the past remain the past. If an Henry had not swallowed his pride and come and asked for forgiveness, would Urezani not have forgiven? Eh? Now there's a generation in your time that are ready to correct and tidy of history. And you want to hold it back? My son, that history was a bad one. You have to correct it. No, mother. This young man is ready to make amends and make sacrifices to appease the heart of Urezani. Accept it, son. Allow the both youth get married. No, mother. We are in serious enmity with the people of Uruza. So as soon as you forget that, the better for all of us. If we refine in Yes. If we refine in us, we will forget Asunta, eh? How could you be so wicked? Asunta, why are you behaving like someone that is possessed? Hmm? Calling me names will not salvage the situation. No, I will not condescend so low as to play deputy wife to a stupid prince who cannot make a solid decision such as picking a wife for himself. I warn you, I will not stand here and watch you speak about my prince in such a manner. Don't try to Please, do. help your faith to dash your hopes on the ground. Prince Ogudiniru or whatever you call him is not looking your way. And I find it impossible to get him to look your way because I hate him. His presence irritates me so much. Asunta, Asunta, please. Eh? You're the only hope we have now. Please help my prince. I don't want him to lose his mother or the throne. Eh? Just all I'm asking is for you to pretend to be the maiden that love him. We all know that there is no maiden. Eh? At least with time, you will convince him to marry me. Be calm. I will not ask as impostor to your prince. If he likes you, he should come here and perform your customary duties. Pay your bride price and take you home as his wife. Look at how you're embarrassing yourself. Throwing yourself cheap at him. Asunta, Asunta, why help me, please? Make me stay. Asunta, if you think so, if you so, you can appoint him. for Ogudumiro to enter into my husband's house. That boy is taking me for granted. I will not allow him to enter into
into this compound until he brings that woman he claimed to have proposed to, which is getting, which he is about getting married to. Please, Your Majesty, allow him come back to the house. I beg you. The girl in question will be here in a few days. Mark my word, I am telling you honestly. There is no point disturbing yourself. I will not open this gate for Gudiniru to enter into this compound. That boy has taken me for granted and I will not let it. Until he brings that woman he said he has proposed to and about to get married to. Until I see that woman, he will not enter into this compound. And you, stop disturbing me. As I will see you as a bad influence who is trying to deceive him from getting a wife. What is this? Please, or are you working for the enemies? Huh? Who is trying to deceive my son? So that they, take, they will take the, 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 real, the real throw, put my husband, got that even unto death. No, no, my queen, no. I am and will always remain a loyal friend to this royal home, your majesty. Please, please just give him this chance. Just give him this one last chance, I beg you, my queen. Please, go and talk to your friend. And stop disturbing me. I'm confused. I'm marry me, I'm gay man. What is a mukan, a kupanu makaya? On your gawamo. On I'm so confused. I'm a resident. My throne has stake. Oh, Guinea, come, get me. On your gawamo. I don't even know what. The truth of the matter is that the prince is not looking at you. And to even make the matter worse, your sister is confronting with your situation. You cannot say that, eh? That's a big thing. There must be a way out. You have to help me now, eh? You need to convince him to, to look my way, even if he's not looking my way now. What do I do? Can you hear me? What do I do? I'm asking you now. You want me to help? Help the prince. Let us secure the truth first. That is the most important thing, right? How do I help the prince? First, yes. talk to your sister. Make her see reasons. Do I say this? I called you here to ask a very important question. Ask him to tell me. What do you want that I, Prince Ogoduniru, cannot give you? Do you want part of my kingdom? You obviously cannot ask for that. It's impossible for a woman to be king in this part of the world. Ogoduniru, you may be a prince, soon to become king, but guess what? I don't care for any of that. You are a very proud man. And even God resists the proud. You want something? Then be ready to give something in exchange for it. After all, life is all about sacrifices. All right, then, name your price. Good. You will finance my education from start to finish. I'll be studying law. Thank you for asking. And when I graduate, you 
will install me as one of the board of executives in your father's company. I'm sorry. That's not possible. I mean, that's too much for a woman like you to ask. You're one... You're... Hey, come on, eh? A secondary school leaver without a defined future? Okay. No problem. Go ahead and defy this offer at your own detriment because I know that the queen, I know that Queen Gosife will not hesitate to pull you out from your father's businesses because you would have proven to be highly incapable. So think about it, my king. I'm sorry. That's if you eventually become one. I'm confused. I'm married. I'm gay man. What is the mukane kupano makaya? Onyega wamo. May your food is in the kitchen. Huh? Okay. You can carry it. If you finish that one and you need more, take more from the pot. Oh? All right, uh -huh. and Whoever disobeys our mother should start fending for herself. Mom, mm. don't touch me. If you touch me, click start pouring. Wait, 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 Mama. What is this? Eh? So you people are continuing with this silent treatment? You people are continuing with it? Why? What nonsense now? When will it end? No, no, you people should tell me. How much longer will it last? It will take as long as you're ready to say sorry for that ridiculous stunt you put out there. Hmm. I do not ask for a human life, oh. I do not, I don't know why you are reacting like this. You and Mama. What I ask for is, is, is something the royal house can afford. I shake it. I something. You lie. You are very, very greedy. I am not. You are. Don't say you're not, though. How could you, Asomta? How could you? You ask the prince to buy you jam from. Then, Okwalu Gilbavo, who are you? I ask you, who are you? I'm not a greedy person. I insist I'm not a greedy person. <laughs> I'm just somebody that saw an opportunity that makes sense and I am choosing to embrace it. What, what wrong is there in doing that? Why, why are you doing like this? Eh? She, she, you are aware of my ambition to become a lawyer. And since I wrote for Ek, time is going. Ekene is here to gather the money he needs to, with which to sponsor me. And here is the prince with the, the money that they have. I'm, I'm building a future here. I'm building a future. This, this is a good opportunity to let sleep. And I mean, if you think about it, it's poverty eradication. Because the earlier I start school, the earlier I become a law student, the earlier I graduate, do law school, get a job, begin to earn money, enough to take care of you and mama. And then the prince, his late father left some money for him. He has money. His late father, he said, not the prince. But he succeeded his father. They have money. She stop overreacting now. Eh? I, I am aware that you're sounding this way because you have emotional attachments to the prince. But it's, it's not enough for you to take it personal. I'm not taking it personal. But you are. I'm not. He's very obvious as something. You are greedy. You demanded for something way, way bigger than you. Bigger than your level! Have you one second consider the fact that maybe, perhaps the prince turned you down because he, he, he sees you as a cheap girl? And now, him and all his splendor, you, you think he will not rate you as a cheap girl? That is why now that the universe has turned it around, he finally needs something from you, from us. It's our chance to tell him that we too were costly. 
You're not seeing the sense in what I'm saying. Ngwan, now you've chased me away. Who would do all those things? You're not chasing me away. I'm saying that even if you're hungry or poor, there are ways that you can carry yourself and, and end respect and integrity. Honor. Every time. From one English to another. Eh? You know, super so you bo. Lawyer, he ma. Use English and spoil everything we are doing in this it's house. Okay. I, I can see it all refuses. You don't want to see reason what I'm saying. Your mind is fixed with a line of thought. I'm done with you. Do, you. do I come across to you as somebody that will just. My prince. My prince, good days. Good day, my prince. Are you surprised? So, I'm here to accept your deal. Yeah, I'm here to accept your, your proposal. You asked for a change of life. You asked to be liberated from poverty. I mean, that's everyone's prayer. Nobody wants to live in poverty. I thought about it and it makes a lot of sense. So I, Prince Oguduniru, am ready to extend a hand of help. I am ready to make you happy, but on my terms. What terms? Good girl. You'd leave with my blind mother? pretend to be my wife. Do we have an understanding? Okay. I'll take your silence to be a yes. said the spirit maiden is here in real life. What? She's here with me. She's here? Yes. Come, my darling. Come hug me. Come, come, come. I'm here. Oh, huh. you're here? Yes. Oh, my darling. What's your beautiful name? Azumpa. My darling, you seem distracted. Is Abdul distracting you? No, mom, I'm not distracting her. 
Agadunuru go. Agadunuru go. So look at how our women stock. Mom, I'm, I'm going. Not until you are gone. Come, come. Don't let him distract you. I'm going to go. Leave us alone. Oh, my love. I'm gone. Go. Fine, Mom. I'm going to make the best choice. You have me say so. You're so beautiful. It's so nice to meet you after all this while. <laughs> You're welcome. Oh, thank you. Hazamta. You're welcome. Vicky, you don't understand. She told my mother her name is Asamta instead of Kira. And she has said she is sorry. Does she need to kill a cow before you accept apology? Uh, uh, my prince, I must be very honest with you. You never told her the rules. And even your mind didn't get to think that the queen would demand her name. Oh! What do you mean by that? She's supposed to be an expert. That's Ex why I'm paying her. Or say expert, me. My prince, she never admitted that she has been an imposter before. This is her first time. This conspiracy, are you supporting her? I am just being justified in my purpose. Thank God, though. Thank God who has sent you as a BK to, to speak on my behalf, to be my advocate. What do you mean, Seth? How, how can I lie about my name? How do you expect me, me as Samta, to lie about my name? When that is not just repugnant, it is highly repugnant to morality, fairness, and good judgment. Um, um, look, my prince, what I'm trying to say is no civil We are on this and we are not going back. When Kira comes, we will tell the king everything. And by then the throne is secured and the marriage sealed. Bam. The king's decision at that time will be able to go And our people, they will honor your wisdom. And an offense ah. <laughs> And my reward intact. Right? Oh, shut up. Right at Eh, eh! Don't try it, though! Don't try to hush me. Talk too much now. I might walk out through that gate, go to my father's house and no, stay no, there. No, 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 no. After all, I do not need to be a graduate to eradicate poverty from my father's house. What's that? By the way, when am I getting enrolled for my jump? So. Good. Huh. Say hello to the soon to be Attorney General of the state. Thank you. <laughs> ah, she's good. She's good. <laughs> Attorney General. I like that. Nice. I'm glad you like her, Mom. I am usurping her cooking duties. Hmm. She will resume as soon as you pay her bright price. <laughs> no one cooks better than you, Mom. Besides, I, I thought you needed a woman who would relieve you of your cooking duties. I mean, just like you said, I need a woman to cook for me. Not a woman, your wife. Ogu Deniru, Mika, your wife. Excuse me, let me get my intro. Mm. My intro. Good morning.
I trust you slept with my love? Yes, I did. Oh, that's great. Um, Mom, careful there. My daughter? You're here? Yes. Hope you slept well. Yes, my friend, I did. <laughs> Mom, you need to be careful, right? Yeah, I am. Um, Mom, mm -hmm. I would like to go see Uncle Okonyi. Okay, that's very important. Yes, yes. Yeah, there you go. Can you please help me with this? Yeah, yeah, sure. All right. Mom, you're not about to play this when... You're not about to play this whilst having your cup of tea? <laughs> I'll play with my daughter Asanta. Oh, that's okay. Um, Mom, Yeah. I have to go see Uncle Okonyi right now. Oh, that's very important. Yes, it's important. Right. You can go. All right. Oh, okay. That's fine. Honey, uh, kindly uh, clear the table when she's she's done. Okay. Yes. Sure. <laughs> that's nice. You're a little more with your wife to be. Yes, exactly. <laughs> Mom, I'll see you shortly, okay? Alright. I'll just go to my room and pick up. Okay. So, Mother. Where are you? I'm here. Okay. Let me bring a tray to clear the spray. Alright. It's good to have a wife. the role of a responsible wife. And what you did in there is one of the qualities of the wife material. It's not part of the plan. And we know it. I'm done with you. You're okay. Oh, oh. No, no. Go and come back and negotiate. You are my rule. Negotiate. What are you trying to tell me? Go and come back first. Just go and come back. It's not part of the deal now. It's not part of the deal. It's not part of the deal. Come back and we'll negotiate. Ah, what is this trying to turn me into? Ah, no deal, bro. Um, I came to the palace yesterday and the queen told me he went out to her with her new found love. <laughs> yes, I did. But she told me, and that's uh, that's why I'm here. Uh, yeah, that's why I came to see you. No. Try it, Uncle. Uncle Curry. Yes, I took a sip before, but I'll just mm. take again. I'll take it. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Really nice. Good. <laughs> um, <clears throat> Uncle Dini, you know, Mom? Yes, Uncle. You've made us proud. Thank you. When are we proceeding for the <coughs> marriage rights process? Um, Uncle, very soon. I mean, one of the reasons why I came to see you. You see, I'd like to uh, call for a brief meeting. huh? Okay. Uh, I would like to speak with the king's men. Your guideline will be highly appreciated. Cons consider it done. Yes. Uh, you know, I, I do not want to make any mistakes at all. Yes. You have all my support. <laughs> <laughs> there, my mom. There, my. Thank you. Hey! Thank you, sir. Uh -huh. Mother, mm -hmm. I must confess I am I am so marveled at the extra sensitivity of your organs. <laughs> your your ability to capture every happening around you in it. I know you'll be wondering. <laughs> yes, I am. But my daughter, you know the sensitivity of the nose and that of the tongue cannot be compared to that of the sight. That is why I can predict everything. Oh. That is why I can predict the taste of my food, to know what to do at every given time. I smell it, I smell things, I sense things. That's to say my sensitivity 
It's very sharp. Tell me, my queen, were you were you blind from birth, or is there is there something that happened to your sight along the way? <laughs> Sometimes. Okay. You're getting to know Kosife. You're getting to know me. There is a lot I'm going to tell you with time. Nobody gets everything. And what it means is, whatever we have, you have to be contented with it. I'm contented with my sight mm -hmm. and the way I am. Where are you? I'm, I'm here. I'm just happy you're here. I'm happy to be here too. <laughs> So the prince walks into his home and you vehemently refuse, or should I say you feel reluctant to welcome you. Welcome you as what? My husband? Please. Do not get overbearing over an undeserved privilege. The last time I checked, I contracted you to do your wifely duty. But what you're demanding is not stated in the contract. Please be guided, Your Majesty. I bought you new clothes because you cannot continue to wear these rags that you brought from your father's house. So now you're going to insult me. Point of correction. Do not raise your voice at me. It's very prohibited around here. My point is, this is a royal family. And I do not want my kinsmen to see you dressed like this. It doesn't suit my personality as a prince. Do you understand that? Sexy, something to convince the entire community that you're the prince's wife. Wow. Besides, wearing rags wasn't part of the contract, it wasn't part of the bargain. Thing. 
washing plates and sweeping the house or doing any chores and wifely obligation. Did you get that? Asanta, remember our interest in accepting that offer. Ah. So you need to be there and pretend to be his wife for some time. Your interest, sister. Your interest because the last time I checked, it is you who has interest in the prince, not me. Get out for. For your information, it helps that you know that the prince never wants to dwell on any topic that has your name on it. Eh? Did he say that to you? No, but his actions imply it. You see, that is more reason you need to go back to the palace. Yes, speak to the prince about it. Make him understand that I am the only woman that loves him. That's why I need you to be in the palace because you are no no. I that big no no. You are impossible. I am here telling you that the mission is futile, and you are convincing me to. The prince has no regard for me whatsoever. And that speaks volumes of how he will regard you if eventually you become his wife. He even referred to my clothes as rags. Mm -hmm. That is stupid. Mm -hmm. eh? Your clothes are uh, like rags now. Mm -hmm. eh? It's not befitting for royalty. Hold it wrong. You need to go back to the palace. Change yourself. To suit my prince, that way this is our deal. I can't be going to prince. I'm begging you. You need to do this for us, for our family, for everybody. <laughs> because, you know, okay? Who's there? Asanta. Yes. I looked for you everywhere. I'm sorry, I stepped out for a moment. Oh, oh. Come play my game with me. Go. Okay. <laughs> it's okay now. So let's play. <laughs> I can actually play it well. Yes, when I was a little girl, I played it a lot with my sister. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> I love the game. <laughs> I do too. Yeah. Let's make the two of us. <laughs> you missed it. No, I'm done. Uh oh. <laughs> I should play now? Yes. <laughs> okay. How do you know the exact place to start from? <laughs> My hand works for me. You know with your hand, do everything. Right. Yes, as a second eye. <laughs> Mother, that is my decision and it is final. Such decision cannot be final because it happened many years ago. You said you want your daughter's happiness. That should be more important to you than trying to impress the dead. Mother, you are forgetting something. It is not my decision, but the decision of our ancestors. Yes, personal decision that was never a tradition. They were not law, but was born out of enmity. You are a king of peace, and that you should represent. I said no, mother. Mother. I can't fathom this. This is 
a culture and tradition handed over to me by our ancestors and I pledge to uphold it. Were you there? Let the past remain the past. If an Henry had not swallowed his pride and come and asked for forgiveness, would Urezani not have forgiven? Eh? Now, now there's a generation in your time that are ready to correct and tidy of history. And you want to hold it back. My son, that history was a bad one. You have to correct it. No, mother. This young man is ready to make amends and make sacrifices to appease the heart of Uwe Zane. Accept it, son. Allow the both youth get married. No, mother. We are in serious enmity with the people of Uwe So as soon as you forget that, the better for all of us. him so much. Grandma, why has father refused to allow me to be with the man that makes me happy? Taban then your father is very stubborn. He feels making or good lose the truth. We justified the wickedness and rejection that Anin remitted on Urezani. Grandma, why is father punishing me like this? What if a good thing who damns me and marries another woman? No. He won't. I am sure of that. Don't worry. As for your father, he will soon allow you to marry a man of your dream. And I miss him. I miss Prince Ogunyiru so much. I miss him. Please bring him to me. I want to see him. It's okay. It's okay. Calm down. You will soon be with him. Calm down, my daughter. It's okay. In your tears. I don't like seeing tears on your face. My throne has stayed. Ogini come me. Onye gawamo. I thought I asked you not to come to the palace. What are you doing? You're right. Hey! Move back. You're what right. are you doing here? You're right, my face. I have an important message to the department of my sister. And it's urgent that I divide him. That's why I'm here. Then do that really fast. I don't want my mother to suspect anything. Go! I said go!
you insist that I must stay in this palace, I have to do this. No. You put your analysis to the expiration of the contract that you get from my gate. No, no, no. You should have said no. How can you go and serve the prince fruit dressed like this? Eh? So that you won't take my money away from me or, or, or eat your. It's the prince. He got this for me. He insists I must wear them and to stay in this palace. He even said I must wear them to the expiration of the contract. I don't even like them myself. You should have refused. You should have said no. Look at this young man. I've been wearing all these normal clothes we used to wear at home now. Eh? At home time. The way this thing is not in the plan so. It's home time. You even had to go school. Rosie and I just met now. You don't wear the game. Now you're wearing engagement ring. Don't worry. Eh? It's home time. If you see just the prince and he makes that devices at you, you will not like it. Oh, the prince. I still know what I'm here. Me seducing the prince for the prince having amorous feelings with me is not part of the contract. I am well aware of that fact. He should better not try to develop any stupid thing. Because he ever comes near me and tries to be funny, eh, I got you. I swear, I will scream and then I take the tear of the blade off and I can try to assault him. Please, let's not go to tonight. I don't want you to see. You do your sister. The reason you're here is to speak on my behalf. Not, you know, it's a lot to take in them. How about we call up the team? Yeah? Let's cancel the entire arrangement. How about that? Mm -hmm. Because I, 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 I am this close to doing so. You can't do that. You can't do that. Don't take my money away from me. Playing wifely obligations to life. So, no husband. It shows in her eyes. She will be fond of you. She would feel safe in your arms. She'll do anything against all odds to be with her man. Ooh. So this ghost lover of yours. Why isn't she creating time to be with you? I mean, why isn't she crawling all over you? I'd like to be alone. You know, the qualities you desire in a woman, my dear sister Chiluta has them. Mm -hmm. If only you look into her eyes, you see them. Chiluta loves you and she means well for you. So why? Why are you not giving those feelings the opportunity to thrive? Why do you ignore her? Why do you ignore her? Why do you have to be so bossy? I'd like why to be still... alone. Why are you so full of yourself? That's what I'm talking about. I'd like to be alone. Don't take that tone. That's enough. You are not my father. Don't yell at me. 